Hi, I'm Steve Chubin at Steve's Sewing and Vacuum Center in King of Prussia, Pennsylvania. And today we're here to discuss how to buy a vacuum cleaner. Talking about vacuum bags, we want to get away from that for a minute to talk about bagless vacuums. Bagless vacuums have become very popular in the last few years. Here's a very popular brand right here. With a bagless vacuum, what you have is you have a dust cup where all the dirt and dust is held in this dust cup. This dust cup fills up very quickly, and generally if you do have carpeting, pets and kids, you may have to empty this from going from one room to the next. If you do have to empty this, we do recommend that you empty this outside due to the fact that when you do empty these and you push this button and the dirt drops out of the bottom here, the dirt and dust will go all over your house. So we do recommend that you do go outside. So the convenience or inconvenience of a, a vacuum without bags would be that if you had to empty this out every room and it's raining or it's snowing and it's wintertime, you're going to have to run downstairs outside and, and empty the vacuum then go back upstairs and continue into the next room. So the bagless vacuums that are on the market, out of the most of the bagless vacuums that are on the market, Dyson is one of the better bagless vacuums, but it is not one that we recommend because we do not recommend too many bagless vacuums due to the fact that you're not really getting all the dirt and dust out of your home. You're just taking it from the carpet, putting it into this container, and then from this container, it's going back into your room, into the air, and then back onto your carpet again. Uh, that, is, uh, that is my opinion about bagless vacuums, and because of that, we do not sell many at our store, but they have been very popular. In most of the bagless vacuums that are on the markets today, you have to buy filters. Even for the Dyson vacuum, you do need to buy filters. So you either buy bags for a vacuum that takes bags, or you buy filters for a vacuum that does not take bags. So either way, you do have to have some out-of-pocket expense on operating any product in your home.